Yo, what's happening, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Subnautica Below Zero. This is definitely the first time I'm doing the intro. Uh, if you haven't already checked out the playlist, if you want to get caught up on things you've not yet seen, you can definitely go ahead and do that. That is uh, very helpful and stuff. But uh, anyways, yeah, we're going to be picking up where we left off last time. I did a little bit of work I'm trying to get this controller to be doing. There we go. I'm running with controller this time. So it's it keeps wanting to open up a tab for some reason, another tab, and I don't know why. And it's fudging fudging things up. But uh, anyways, welcome guys, welcome to Subnautica. Uh, Wolfwood says I like this way of doing things. You like the um, keeping the stream running and just jumping into the next game. I kind of like it too, and I think honestly it'll be better for views as far as like re-uploading them because it's uh, you know its own separate video, so it's gonna get hit by the algorithm differently. I don't know. We shall see. Uh, Cap says, yeah, first time. Right. Yeah, yeah. I definitely didn't do the intro without having the mic turned on. <laughs> but this time, I did remember to hit record. So I'm actually recording the video for me to edit and then put back up later. So <clears throat> there is that. Yeah, see, I think it kind of will lose me viewers if I end the stream and start a new stream because you know those viewers that were already there they're gonna end up booted out and having to you know find and click on a new stream so i think th i think this way will just keep me with my viewers consistently still watching you know so long as they enjoy both games that i'm playing but who doesn't like subnautica below zero fantastic game the best Alrighty, so let's see. I'll show you guys what I have done since the last one, which is a little Power bit of restored. organization. All primary systems online. Um, I brought some of my items into here. This can be like kind of my chest room. Uh, I kind of wanted to make a, whatchamacallit, a jukebox, but I couldn't find the jukebox. I'm not sure where that, where you actually craft that. Uh, maybe Wolfwood's knows, or maybe one of these other guys knows in the chat can let me know. But, um, yeah, I don't know where you make a jukebox. I added a few more eggs. I had some extra eggs laying around that I didn't realize I had, so I threw them in there. But a lot of my creatures have hatched. We've got a lot of, um, yeah, a lot of good creatures swimming around in here. It's very, very nice. Cap says you have to find fragments. Uh, but I'm pretty sure that, um, let's see. I'm pretty sure I had it unlocked. Um, where is that going to be at? Let me make sure here. Uh, yeah, we have it unlocked. I just don't know where do I craft it. Quartz and titanium. Uh, Turbo says, why no squid shark? Uh, we just have not found that one yet. I haven't been going bonkers on searching, so. In the building tool. Oh, okay. Let's see here. Oh, that makes sense. Is that interior module? Okay. Nice. So let's build a jukebox. Let's see if I have any quartz. Uh... Should be over here if I have any. And you can upload their custom songs too. Oh, hey, that's nice. Dude, we can throw my uh, my songs in there. Do I have more eggs? Is that another egg that I missed out on? No, that's bullseye stuff. Okay. Uh, let's see if I have any quartz. That's an empty one. I have one quartz. I think I need a second quartz, don't I? Oh, no, we only need one. We just need a little more titanium, which I don't know that I have. Oh, I do have the titanium. Nice. We're making a jukebox. <clears throat> Dude, custom songs would be nice. Can we build this in the sea truck, though? Uh, Turbo misses me a crash fish. Cap wants the pee-pee-poo-poo -poo song. Oh, no. Not this again. Let's 
I don't know if this if this will work, but can we if we could put this in the C truck, that would be super nice. Like let's uh let's put this thing together. Or is there like a jukebox module for the C truck? You can, but you need a custom C truck capsule. Ah. Uh, I see. So this won't this won't work. Hmm. Cuz I'd like to, I mean I have enough to build one of them. So I'd like to have it I think in my C truck cuz we're going to be in the C truck more often when we're venturing out. So, should we see Welcome maybe if we can Captain. build a uh, C truck part that will allow me to do that? Where's the front of my base? Where is my builder doohicker? And I re recommend building speakers too. Does it not work without speakers? A C truck module. Dang it, why does it always do that? Um. If we drop it, does that put it out? Okay, yeah, it does. Yeah, it always makes me pick it up. I'm trying to climb on it. <clears throat> it works, but I think your music... You want your music to be everywhere in the base? Oh, okay. Aquarium, docking, fabricator, teleportation, storage, sleeper. Okay, so I don't have anything... Uh, Professor Jungle says I have to go have a nice dream. Bye. Alrighty, uh, Professor Jungle. Appreciate you being here and watching and stuff. You have a good rest of your day. Take it easy, bud. Alright, so we'll put the jukebox in here for now because I guess we can't really, uh, put it in the sea truck. We can actually put it in here. I think this will be a good spot for it. And, um, I can have some music when I go to sleep at night, you know? I think that'll be nice. I went to sleep. I don't know. <laughs> I meant to build that and I accidentally went to bed. Uh, oh, it's A to construct. I think I was hitting the wrong button, maybe. The jukebox lets you listen to music in your base. No one said survival. Couldn't be funky. Funky, yeah. Let's get funky with it. I think I have a disc somewhere. I thought I did. Maybe it's in my sea truck storage. Let's go check it out. I swear I have a disc that I picked up from somewhere. I kind of want to hear how this sounds without speakers. And then we'll throw some speakers up in the rest of the base, I think. But it's either in the sea truck or the prawn suit. Um, empty. Uh, maybe over here. There's just some rotting stuff in there. Rotting stuff. Oh, we got some some of this stuff. I guess we'll grab this. More rotting stuff. Just all the rotting stuff. Um, oh, look at that. We have some... We actually had some good stuff in here. How did I not realize? We do have... Where the heck's my music disc? Did I not pick up... I swear I picked up a music disc. What do heck? Where is it gone? Welcome aboard, Captain. What the butts? Is it possible for me to craft one? God dang it, that's that's butts. 
If I'm missing my music disc, I'm going to be so upset. That one's empty. This one's the valuable. We got everything all sorted out real nice. Uh, I need to find somewhere to put these things, the nuclear rods. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. I guess those can go in here. You know, we have a whole empty locker. Let's keep this for the nuke stuff. All right, I got to find the music disc. Where the heck did I... Did I leave it somewhere? Did I not pick it up? What the butts? I can't do nothing. I have to go soon as well in like 12 minutes. All right, no worries. What up, Toon Pirate? Welcome to the stream. First time chat from Raider. Raiding party. Oh, wait, that's S video. The Q is raiding with six. Oh, no, what's up? How's it going? I didn't even notice that. Uh, much appreciated. Welcome, welcome. Here to pillage. Heck yeah. Here to party. I was just about to party. I thought I had a music disc for my uh, jukebox that I just built, and I can't find it. Cass says, don't put a lot of them in one place or it will blow up. Oh, really? Will that really happen? If you put a bunch of these in one spot, will it actually blow up? Hey, uh, thanks a bunch for the, uh, for the raid. That's awesome of you. All right, somewhere, I swear, somewhere, there has to be a music disc. I'm telling you. If not, I'm going to be very, very upset. This one's empty. Seek fluid intake. And I need to seek fluid intake. Garsh, darn it. Vital signs stabilizing. Well, anyways, let's go ahead and let's go on an adventure. We have the map. Uh, that's the wrong button. I'm using a controller for the first time, so I'm kind of still like trying to figure out what the heck I'm doing. Let's see, where was that at? Maps. We have a map, and so we can go do some more exploration. Wolf says, still on call, uh, watching the stream. Hope you're not talking about a bunch of secrets I'm missing out on because I have you muted. Oh, I gotcha. Yeah, no, you're, you're not missing much, Wolfwoods. We just built that, um, the heck is that noise? We just went and built the jukebox, but I actually don't have a music disc to put in it. I swore I did, but I guess I don't, and I'm very bummed about it. So instead, we're going to go investigate. So if we head, um, I'm trying to figure out what these spots are. Do we want to go to the east, to that like lily pad zone, lily pad looking zone? Of course not, Jake. I'm just joking. See, I, w I wasn't sure if you had some like secret knowledge that maybe I didn't know about. I was like a little bit worried. Something just hit my, my truck. But yeah, let's head east. Let's go to the lily pad zone. Maybe if we got time, we can explore like a couple of these areas. We shall see. Pin a carrot egg discovered. Oh, one of my eggs must, must have hatched. We'll go back and check that out later. Caps is two pranks on account today. Yeah, you're, you're getting everybody today. Cap is going for it. Now, I don't know. Like, the map, I don't think, shows me how far away this place is. Hopefully, it's not super dangerous. I think a lot of places are dangerous. Cap's going to prank himself today, too. I'll prank you. I'll prank everybody. I'll even prank myself. Go to the dead zone? Is that where I'm heading? Is that actually the dead zone? 
Well, because it shows, like, the lily pad area. Like, there's green over there. So I figured that wasn't a dead zone, but may maybe it is. It's, like, one of the areas where my map says to go. Cap says there's a pee-pee poo-poo song disc. How do you go about adding your own songs in? Because that would be kind of cool. I could always do that. But uh, I'll have to figure out how you how you actually go about that. Wait, I'm going to hit a wall here, aren't I? How do I continue on? Or we can go around it, maybe? Through? God dang it. I'm hitting into stuff real bad. I'm getting frigged up here. My poor ship. I am a horrible driver. Through files. This is so disorienting. I feel like I should be facing a different... Like, I'm turning my head trying to make this better. I feel like I should not be facing the way that I'm facing. It's so weird. Anyways, hopefully... Uh, well, I think all the raiders from uh, S-Video, the Q, they, um, they probably know this game better than me. So maybe there's people who can give me some advice. That's not Cap just uh, trolling me. <laughs> Cap says, Jake, remember, every way it leads to Rome. Well, we'll get there eventually then, I guess. Uh, S Video the Q says you're further than I am. Oh, okay. And uh, your first time playing it? I like this area with these whales. This is nice. Yeah, it's your first time. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, this is my first time too. I played um, the first Subnautica and then uh, we jumped into this. I'm very nervous about going into this area because this is dead zone, right? And uh, things get bad out here. But there should be some green stuff up top, right? Like on the map, you can see green. Maybe we stick to this uh, icy zone over here. The lily pads? No, they're not. Are they under the water? Oh, no, they're lily pads. They should be above the water. They're not out this far? Is that what you're saying? Cap wants me to spell I cup. That's the oldest one in the book there, Cap. You ain't getting nobody with that one. They're lily pads, but he says they're not above. They're below. That's odd. You'd think lily pads would be on the surface. Calorie intake recommended. All right, I guess, if I have to. You're going to make me. We we'll a couple Vital fish. Signs, Drink some recycled water. Cap says, I got you already two times, Jake. You are Jake Ape. They're above now, says Turbo. Okay. That's what I thought. That's what I figured they would be. God dang it. I'm hitting so much stuff. Am I the worst sea truck driver in the world? I feel like I've been out to these things before, but I didn't get uh, I didn't get attacked or anything. But then I come out here bef last time, and there's some bad stuff coming up from the depths, so I don't want to really go out too far. I have accidentally. Yeah, I did. I found the area before on accident, really, and now it's like that I'm looking for it. I'm not going to find it. 
I don't want to go out too far out this way because it's going to get real sketchy. I feel like you would see like the stalks grow growing up from the bottom or something, you know? I don't know. I guess we'll just head east. Let's head east until bad things happen. It's getting dark. Oh god, this is getting real, real sketchy. I don't like this one bit. Here comes things. Very dark, and there's the thing. <laughs> oh no. How am I supposed to do this if this thing's gonna be here? Just swim one direction, the worst that can happen is the void. Yeah, the worst that can happen is that. I guess we could continue heading like sort of southeast and see see if we get somewhere. I don't know, I just feel like there would be things to spot, you know, like uh, from a distance. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? Um, I forgot to change on Twitch that I'm playing a different game. I should probably do that. Um, Cap said, well, you're not the only one on the planet, so it makes you the best driver. But if you say you are the worst one, you're the only one there, that makes it worse. It makes you pathetic driver. Well, we haven't, we don't have any knowledge of how, uh, how well the other lady, Margaret, drives. We don't know if she's a good or a bad driver. So we don't have like a we don't have like a reference. She could be a better driver than me. So I could still be the worst. Oh, I found lily pads. Nice. Okay, so there should be a structure in this zone. She walks with the prawn. Yeah, she walks more than drives, I think. I, I haven't seen her driving. Oh, that's, uh... That's scary. She tamed and rode on a freaking Leviathan, Jake. Yeah, true. So, are you saying she's a better driver than me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is a cool area. Is there any frogs around here? You'd think you'd see a... Oh, I keep forgetting how long my vehicle is, and I'm wrecking it into stuff. You'd think there would be frogs here. Now, if I were somebody trying to have a, like, secret base or something, where would I, where would I put that? I'd put myself in the mindset. Here you can find the glow whale eggs. Yeah, we'll grab some if we see them. Also, that's just a uh, whatever you call it. Just some kind of ore. God dang it, man. I'm smashing the back of my ship. It's too long, you know. You're not used to driving such a long vehicle. Oh, maybe down. Yeah, it could be under underneath. All right, so what we can do, I'm thinking it probably is down here, right? We park our sea truck. We hop out. They're pretty hidden in the grass, says Turbo. Oh, they, those eggs. So we'll park this. We'll come back here. We'll hop onto the prawn suit, and we'll dive on down into this. Uh, I still have stuff in here. Oh, I, I did check here for the disc and I didn't find it. I have a bunch of posters but no disc. Welcome aboard, Captain. Let's like dive on into the crack. I don't think this is somewhere I've been before. Grab it, grab it, grab it. God dang it, why don't you grab? 
God dang it, stop rolling away. Just grab it. There you go. Gently, gently pick that up. Come on. <laughs> I hate trying to grab things from inside the prawn suit. Gently pick that up. There we go. All that for one piece of gold. Now this... No, I think I have been here before, haven't I? Cap says fading away. You're fading away, Cap? Uh, sea truck afterburner upgrade. Yes, I want that. Why? Yo, Cap has been a member for 13 months. Holy schmoly, man. That is bonkers. Much appreciated, my dude. Uh, Cap's going to sleep. All right, he sounds good, buddy. You have a good night, a good sleep. Thanks for being a member for 13 months. That is really crazy. You're awesome, dude. Much, much appreciated. Uh, have I never scanned a sea monkey? Stay here, monkey. The friendly sea monkey. I guess I never have been here. If I, uh, you know, I didn't grab that scannable right there. Or I could have just missed it. Well, I don't even know how to pronounce that name. H O 1 O Wachuk. I'm just going to call you Wachuk. Welcome to the stream. Wachuk says, Gamers. Why are you scanning yourself? I don't. Oh, because I'm a monkey. Gosh dang it. Just say, I don't think I've scanned myself, but you're. Come on, Cap. Come on, my dude. Call me a monkey. Anything here? Um, grappling arm? Oh, I like the grappling arm. I actually do like that a lot. Anything in your nest that I can grab? And then what is this? Is that uh, silver? I think we're good on that. I have a lot of silver. What I really need to do is, I think, like, find a way farther down. Uh, vertical thrust is... Okay, I see. That's different. That's definitely way different. Yeah, that's weird that this button does that. That also does that. That does that. I don't have like a jump button. I just have the vertical thrust. That's weird. Playing on a controller is a little little different. That's for sure. Wolf on fire. What up, Wolf on fire? Did you finish up your uh, your call? Um, what do we have here? I don't think there's anything there to scan. We found, um, so we found, like, the lily pad zone, and there's another supposed to be, um, another, like, outpost here or something, and so I'm looking around down in here trying to see if I can find anything. I'm not, I'm not seeing much, so it might not be down in this cave zone. This might just be monkey nests. Uh, good night, Cap. Oh, I missed the part where he said three jokes. He's he's dropped three jokes today on different people. Cap the Joker. C truck horsepower upgrade. I have half of that. This is good though. I mean, I'm getting a lot of good getting a lot of good stuff here. Ultra capacity tank fragment. Oh, nice. I need 3 of those. Yeah, that's the big problem finding the rest of those. Always have a big struggle trying to get to like the next um, 
the next level of getting all those things. Okay, I'm still in the lily pad zone, right? See, Wolf has played this before too, so he's got he's got a, a lot of knowledge on uh, where the things are. We want to be in the lily pad zone, and there should be something down here. I don't know if it's down here or if it's up there in one of those big rocks or something. But there should be something here. Is this uh, the same hole we just went into? Or is this a new hole? This is a sea monkey zone, so this might be the same hole I was just in already. It goes down. Going down a ways deeper, though. Hopefully it's not too deep for my thing to take. Oh, what have we found? What the heck have I just found? Uh, Mr. Alien, I would like some information here. Marine life analyzer. Oh. So can we use that for stuff? And or things? I would greatly enjoy using that for stuff and or things. What is this? Silver? Alright, so that's a, definitely a find, but not what I'm necessarily looking for. Oh? Turbo will be happy we found an egg. Eggs have been located. I don't know what kind of egg that's going to be, but we'll, uh, we'll find out when it hatches. Oh, wait, can you... That's what I was wondering. Can you use this thing to analyze... Because it's a creature analyzer. Can I use it to uh, find out what this egg is? That was my uh, my question. Or is this not... Is it not powered? Am I not able to do stuff with this? Maybe it's just not... That's what it's called, but it's not actually going to do stuff for me. find where this it can't be that I mean it should be a pretty big structure right I'm looking for a, a base it, you you know you'd think it would stick out everything's all natural and stuff and then you should have a man-made looking base somewhere but that is not the case And these ones, I might have already been here already, so we can uh, move on to a new zone, maybe. Calorie intake recommended. Unless maybe it goes a bit deeper. Uh, what do we have? We just have this nutrient block. I guess that's Vital good. Signs stabilizing. And we can use some recycled water. Another one. I don't know if I've grabbed these before. Turbo did say you could find the, um, like the whale, whatever the whale thing is, you could find that, so maybe that's what that is. Oh, no, 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 no. Now this, do we need to, uh, put something on here, or well, this, the this is captured. what it is? God dang it, I'm gonna get blown up. I hate those things so much. 
It's a good good discovery day. We're we're finding lots of interesting things. Is that something I can grab? Docking module. Now we find it. Now we find all the docking modules. Now that I already have it. What the heck is a fumarole? So this looks interesting. Is this... Uh, I think I've been to this one already, haven't I? Yeah, I've been here already. Gosh darn it, I thought I was on to something. What is this, though? Lithium? Sure. Lithium's handy. Salt? Always handy. Well, that's... But I've already been to this one, but somehow I missed that sea truck docking module. I've been looking for it for so long, and there was one right there that I missed. I wonder if there's anything over here. Anything? Any, like, secret base or something hiding out? That would be uh, interesting if you had something like that hanging out around here. Oh, what do we have here? Is that just back to the alien? That's the alien ruins. That's where I was just at. <laughs> Alright, so we've, we've kind of explored all this, I think, already, so... I think uh, we need to find a new direction to go. So to do that, we need to head back up to the surface, back to the ship, and then from there we'll uh, we'll find a new a new area, a new zone. Well, it's got to be in this zone. It's got to be in the lily pad zone. Just a matter of where. Where the frig. It's just so, so vast, the open ocean here, that, uh, you know, it could literally be anywhere. Maybe we dock back up and swim up a ways and see if, like, maybe I missed something on one of these big rocks. Uh, Wolfwood says, all right, I'm back. What secrets did I miss? There's uh, not been really any secrets. I've just been kind of looking around trying to find where this, uh, whatever the thing is going to be in the lily pad zone. So, like, I'm over here in the lily pad zone. There should be some kind of structure, I think, right? According to the map. So I'm just kind of looking around trying to find out where that might be. I don't know if it's down or if it's up or what. We just looked a bunch of places down below and I didn't see anything. There's your good old uh, squid shark. ship is all turned sideways see there's all these like rock bundle things underneath of here so I was wondering if maybe on one of these rocks there was something so I figured I'd try and head up and look at these a little better some of them are pretty big see like that there's an opening don't know if there's going to be much to it But there is a crack here. I feel like I might have actually checked out this crack already. I'm generally, uh, 
you know, really digging into cracks a lot of times. It doesn't, <laughs> that doesn't sound right, but <laughs> that's that's what we're doing. We're digging in cracks. Maybe it's um, up top. You think it could be up top on one of these lily pads? Can I actually get up out of here? I don't know if I can actually get on top of these, can I? You're friendly, right? You're friendly? Do you like being scanned? Have, have you already been? Oh, you... Oh, you're the trippy, you're the trippy alien. Yeah, okay, I remember you now. You're the, you're the one who sends me on a trip. Whoa. God dang. That's some good, some good stuff. Look at that quartz. A, dr uh, a drug trip? Yeah, like, I mean, it's... It's far out, man. Oh, am I better? Is it over? That's an interesting alien to have added to your game. A, an alien that makes you um, trip. Very, very interesting. So it doesn't seem like up on these rocks like there's much, much going on. It kind of looked like it was in the middle of the lily pad zone. Frig. I don't know how big this lily pad zone actually is. Well, I just made some fresh water. I, I should probably drink that. Drink my fresh water I just made. Stop running into me, fish. What's happening? Am I still hitting something? It's uh, it's kind of nice having the the controller in your hand because you get like the vibrations whenever things are happening. So like, it kind of lets me know that I'm hitting stuff a little bit more. Or so I feel like than when I'm playing on the mouse and keyboard. It's like I could be driving by just scraping on a rock. Uh, yeah, I've switched to controller. I was playing the um. The last one with controller too. I just got a new controller. I actually only bought it for my uh, for my Switch for playing on the Switch. I was like, you know what? Why not try going uh, doing it on some games? Honestly, unless I'm getting really into a first-person shooter, I prefer controller. Yeah, see, I've always I've always been a console gamer. I've always played Xbox. So like switching to mouse and keyboard was kind of. A big change for me so like I I'm actually I was used to controllers more before I don't even know what I just bought this on um, you know Timu I bought it on Timu it was some like random brand I don't even know <laughs> I don't know how good it is oh I think I just found it did I just freaking find it holy schmoly what luck ha oh boy Timu yeah see I'm making a a video on it actually uh turbo gotta go now see you later king jake all right we'll see you later turbo did you notice i got a couple eggs i don't know if they were the eggs you're talking about but uh wolf said and you actually got the item i'm impressed yeah i did uh so i did a couple i've done a couple video well this will be my second video whenever i finish it but i did a first video on timu where i went and i ordered a bunch of items it gave me like half of them for free and then the other half I paid for. So I did like an unboxing of um, Timu items. And uh, I mean, I got all of them. They all they all showed up. They all were like decent quality. Uh, actually, this phone case that I have on my phone, 
I got off of uh, Timu. The glow whale takes like six to four spacey. Oh, it's a big one. Okay, yeah, that makes sense that it would be a big one. So yeah, I mean, I don't think Timu is like. I titled the video, you know, obviously is Timu a scam, but you know, a scam, but. Um, I think they they're actually legit. Just depends on the quality of stuff you're gonna get. Is I think the main thing. <clears throat> How do I get in here? I have this big open this big open space here for me to explore, and there's I can't find my way in. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's there's no air in here. Yeah, that's right, because this isn't powered. We do have a scannable here. Multi-purpose room with a glass dome. Oh, that's cool. Yo, that's gonna be nice. I don't know. Can't see. I trust it personally, but glad it worked out. Yeah, I mean it. They they deliver, but like I said, it's just like you're. I guess you're kind of risking on like, is the quality of it gonna be decent? Yeah, we at the we at the base. So I think there's probably gonna be good stuff to find in here. I don't know if this is what I was actually like looking for, but I'm glad I found it. I think maybe this continues on farther down. There's like light over there. Uh, you know what? I remember I said I was gonna listen to while we're going, just listen to some more of these things. So we're gonna listen to some stuff. David. You'll be happy to know the Frost Pack is making excellent progress. I must say, my management style appears to be uniquely well suited to isolated planets. I miss you, of course, but I wonder if you feel it too. As great as we are together, we're almost better apart. Just look at how well Prosperina did in her last show. I'm sorry I couldn't be there to see it, but I'm sure if I'd been around, I'd only have made her nervous. Once hmm. this mission is over, I'll come home for a few good months. And then, what do you think if we look at reorganizing our expectations to facilitate longer-term separation success? What I really heck? think this could be a great model for us going forward, romantically and otherwise. Don't forget, Dude. <laughs> I love you from the depths of my heart. Keep on succeeding in your projects. You know there's nothing I find more attractive. The heck is going on with this dude? Architect research notes. Let's uh, play that. While other teams I got so many. I just I'm gonna listen to one and two, to one or two here the and there. Architects. I've tried to take a more practical approach. We know these part organic, part digital beings stored what they thought of as themselves on computers within their sanctuaries, and we know efforts to wake or communicate with them have been in vain. My theory is that to make first contact, these digital ghosts must first be recombined with an organic component. Hmm. As Dr. Kaz Slaney's classic study noted, we know they had means to grow cybernetic bodies and to transfer their data patterns between them. There is a known probable architect sanctuary in this sector, but entry is not currently possible. If I can get inside and present the right vessel, I do think we will be successful. I'm picking up like everything. There's so many, just like photos, like uh, portraits Danny's and stuff. Not here, I'm afraid. That's okay. It's you I wanted to see. What's that you're working on? Just a sketch for a piece I want to make. <sighs> I'm slacking off. Don't tell the boss lady. <laughs> I won't. It's beautiful. What is it? I'm doing a series inspired by bacteria, mutant beauty, life, death, risk. You know, that kind of thing. What's this one? It looks like Harab, but Vin, is this a mutation? It's just an art project. You know you're doing that thing with your neck, like when you're trying to bluff an alien intruder? <sighs> right, fine. Fine. I'm bad at lying. Are you mutating Harab bacterium from the frozen Leviathan here in this lab? Please Ooh. don't ask me any more questions. I don't think I need to. That's sketchy. Dude, he's... He was like 
mutating the virus. That's so bad. So is that all there is to this? I think I've I think I've pretty much tapped this place out. There wasn't a whole lot here, but there is some good uh, info stuff. We're gonna listen to more stuff. Communications tower maintenance lock. Another day, another slight by the winged furies. As usual, I got an interference alert. As usual, I went out to see what the problem was. As usual, it was frozen stalagmites of feather bird excrement. <laughs> this guy's so angry. I fear the career impact of saying this officially. If you can even call what I have a career. But I could swear they're targeting me personally. The week I was out with the flu, I came back to find the tower spotless. Parvin laughed at me when I asked him how he cleaned it. Silly me. As if Parvin would ever clean anything. There's nothing left for me to do but quit. But I know that's what the birds want me to do. Oh, and I got the tower up and running. Maintenance complete. Turbo said, uh, Jake, why don't you make a glass top to your big room? Yeah, if I can do that. I don't think I can just, like, add that on, can I? I'll have to make, like, a new room, kind of. A new glass top room. But uh, that would be that would be neat. That would be interesting. So I don't know. Is there more to this, or is that it? This base was kind of a bit small, but uh, Wolfwood got to go get lunch, walk the dog before it starts raining. All right. No worries. Good luck and Godspeed. All righty, buddy. I appreciate you being here and watching and stuff, and uh, you have a good lunch and a good dog walking. Take it easy, my friend. We'll see you later. Yeah, maybe down this crack. Have I been down this crack? This is probably a crack that I've already dug into. But we're going to dig into it again. Uh, you can look in the building tool. Let's see. Oh, that puts me out of the ship. Um, you can add on to your thing, or like you can build multi-purpose room glass dome. Okay, so you can just build the dome on top of what's already there. I could just build a whole observatory. That'd be kind of cool. Yeah, we can maybe do that. Gonna need a bit of enamel glass, which I think I have. So that would be that would be kind of nice. Uh, I'll keep it running for them numbers, and if you're still gonna be here in an hour, I'll join up again. Alrighty. Yeah, I think. Uh, actually, I'm actually almost been doing this for an hour, so. I'm probably going to end off here soon. Maybe go for like another half hour. We'll see. But uh, Wolfwoods dropped at $2 on the YouTubes. Much appreciated, Wolfwoods. A pixelated hippo chomps on a one-up. <laughs> Very nice. Much appreciated, buddy. And I appreciate you keeping the stream open. You, uh, you have a good one. I probably won't be here when you get back, I think, but... Yeah, take it easy. Wolf on fire. Absolutely, the wolf is on fire. I need to look into my notifications a bit more, I feel like. You remember you were saying uh, if you could do the emojis that you use for those $2 um, chats, if you could like make those show up on screen, which I, there may be a way. I'd have to look into it. Cheers. Uh, Turbo said, yes, but it seems you don't have the blueprint for it. You only have the circle room. There's a big room glass top. Oh, okay. So I could do on a, a circle room, I could do a glass dome, but not on the big room. Here you can find the squid shark egg. I wonder if there's anything else here. There should be more to this lily pad zone, I feel like. Like some main story stuff other than just that base. Let's go ahead and queue up another um, sea truck log. Let's play that. Cheese on a cracker. Saw Cheese me. Cheese on a cracker. Managed to eject the cargo modules and hide. Sitting here with the lights off, sweating through my shirt. I'm not going to get pooped out of the back end of a sea monster to save <laughs> Altera some money. 
Manuel, not going to be happy. Not one bit. I would not get pooped out of a freaking sea monster for Altera either. We're gonna go off in well, the prawn suit. Captain. That's just titanium. I thought it might have been something a little, uh, a little better. I'm looking for lead. Uh, lead's always a tough one. Uh, probably go check Margaret's uh, greenhouse. I already went to the greenhouse. We already talked to Margaret um, at her greenhouse. So, oh, nickel. Yes, we need nickel. Titanium. So yeah, there's not, I don't think there's anything else. Oh, for the glass top? I don't know that there's anything else to do at the greenhouse. Maybe that, but. I feel like I scanned everything at her house though. So I'm not, I'm not too sure on that one, on that note. We've grabbed these before. These are flower spores. I don't know what I'd do with those. Margaret's underwater house. Yeah, I scanned that, I think, already, too. Pretty sure I scanned all there is to scan at those places. Chance of silver. We don't need that. I'm grabbing some nickel if I find it. Guess we'll take some titanium. Why not? Just check, says Turbo. Uh, I'll tell you what, I will look off camera whenever I'm uh, on here just doing my random like gathering and stuff like that. I'll go over there and I'll check. But for right now, we got like probably, I, I'd say I'll go for another half hour here. And um, I want to keep going on this train of exploration, you know what I mean? It'd probably be worth it if it works. Yeah. For sure. Make my base a little bit more upgraded if, if it's actually uh, there. Or, you know, if I actually haven't scanned it already. Let's see here. There's... I don't know if I've been this deep down here. I feel like I've been in this area before, but I I, I don't know. I don't remember. Uh, there's just so many areas in this place. What is that? Something need a punch? Yeah, I feel like I've been here before, right? Yep, I definitely have been here, because this is, uh, there's no portal here, is there? There's one place I found that was like a portal, but you have to, you have to fix the, uh, how do I jump? There's a way to jump, right? Aha, found it. Um, I think you have to fix the alien guy before you can do the portal. Turbo says probably a squid shark. Yeah, probably. Either way, I don't want to hang out and find out. Much safer in this alien cave. Dude, if I was, uh... If I was, like, stuck living in the ocean like this and I found this place, I would probably move in down here. They're growing plants. Like, it's a nice dry area. I'm sure, it's a cave, but, like... I would probably live down there. Turbo says you can find the egg. The egg. I'm not seeing any eggs. I mean, I've been looking at the floor and stuff. I've been looking around. I'm just not really seeing them. There's the trippy alien. We are getting a decent bit of nickel, so that's handy. Can always use more nickel.
Unlucky, I guess? Yeah. I, it seems like I tend to be very unlucky when it comes to Subnautica. Whether it's below zero or the original, like, I, I would struggle so bad to find things. I just have the unlucky Subnautica gene. Like, even right now, we're looking for what should be, I'm assuming, a big base or something that we need to go, like, explore to further the story, but I'm not really finding any, uh, anything. Calorie intake recommended. Oh, of course, and I have no food, I think. Um, I didn't mean to get out of this, but I did anyway. Yeah, we're out of food. I can drink some water. Will that make me not so hungry? Let me see if there's some stuff I can eat at the back at the trucky Timmy. I jumped on top of it and it didn't dock up. Why would you not dock up? Can I go at it front ways? Yeah, okay, you can do front ways. I always try and back it up to it, and it's like, it's always a struggle. That's empty. Uh, where's my food at? Do I have any food in here? Can I eat these? Can I eat that? It's, okay, I can consume it. Oh, that hurts. Oh, that's, that's horrible. You don't want to eat that. I might have to run home because I don't have any food and I'm out of... I just I just damaged myself by doing that. Decomposing. Okay, we can eat this. Maybe this will help. It's decomposing. Okay, that helps. That does help. I'm still in bad shape though. I think I need to head home. I don't want to eat whatever those things are that I just ate. Lesson learned. Gonna head our way back to home base. Emergency. Starvation imminent. Oh, I know. See yeah, I know. It. Take immediately. It's, it's pretty bad. I think I need to go back this way. Things are things are dire. Things are a little rough right now. I should have planned a little farther ahead when it comes to the food. I kind of just was eager to get out and go, so I left, and I didn't bring much with me. Feel like Bilbo Baggins running down the road without even bringing my handkerchief. God dang. Oops. My ship's gonna be freaking broken down by the time I get out of this crack. Dug too deep in the crack. Will I make it home before starvation hits? Well, I could grab some of these fish and just eat them raw, right? Like, there is a whole lot of fish here. If I get out, can I? Are these ones I can actually grab, or are these the fake ones? There's this. New a new discovered. fish? Wow, I want to eat that. I love when I find new creatures and just immediately consume them. That's great. Aquarium. I think I already have the aquarium. A bladder fish, which I really don't need water. I've been making my own water pretty, pretty consistently to where I haven't really needed it. Is that another newt fish, though? I would like to grab... Why you know let me grab? Okay, we got it. I can actually cook it or cure it because I do have... I forget that my base is like... Or my sea truck is kind of equipped like a base. I can actually cook stuff inside of my, uh, my, my base here. So we can, we can stop the starvation.
We shall survive. We can even make a water too. Why not? I don't like to use the bladder fish for not making water. It just doesn't make sense to cook them and eat them when they're so useful as, as a water source. Even though I'm making my own water all the time. Vital signs stabilizing. Nice. We're good. That's pretty handy. I actually could keep exploring because we can just do that if we need to. We found the base, but we haven't found much else as far as like a story progression. Squid sharks are out here. Is he coming for me? Don't be coming for me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please don't attack. Please don't attack. I didn't do anything. I'm just exploring. I'm a simple explorer. Maybe what I'm looking for is on an iceberg? You think that would be the case? Gosh darn it. Dang you freaking butthole -inies. It's in the uh, in the lily pad zone, but maybe it's up top of one of these. There are some penguins for me to steal. Dangerous weather climbing. I'm climbing to the Seek top shelter. of this thing. I don't care. I need to get a higher vantage point. I need to look out over the area and see what I can see. I don't care what anybody says. Freak the dangerous weather. I'm not scared. Okay, so there's the lily pad zone. And map shows. Let's see what map shows. Um, logs and communications. Maps. Oh, that doesn't help me much, does it? Yeah, that doesn't really help much. And I'm freezing. I must zoom. Oh no. It's very cold up here. So it's definitely not going to be in the iceberg zone. We've already explored a lot of these icebergs. It's going to be in the lily pad zone, but I didn't get much help from the map, really. So we're gonna we're gonna head back over here. You know, if it was me, one of these floating rock islands would make a good place to put like a base or something. That would just be my thought. But Altera is definitely not me. They are not thinking the same way. I think it was just the small base. You think that's all there was? I feel like there's got to be more. But maybe not. All right, anyways, we, we might as well just head home. We can come back if like it turns out there is more there, but we have more um, yeah we have more areas to explore. I gotta kind of try and figure out where they're at. But we'll head our way home, back to the good old home base. I should probably do a save. I haven't done that this whole time. I'm very bad about doing that all the time.
We did get some eggs. I don't know what kind of eggs they are, but I'm going to throw them in the... Uh, I think, wouldn't it tell me, if I've already discovered them, won't it tell me that what kind of egg it is when I pick it up or when I look at it? Yeah, we can put the eggs in the aquarium, see what they are. I feel like I really need the speed upgrade on this thing. It's just so slow. Oh, and while we're cruising, since we don't have music, let's uh, listen to some more stuff. There I was, 500 meters below sea level. Chunks of the sea base sank around me. One hand gripped the monster scales. The other was clamped around the shard of metal I'd lodged into her eye socket. A reaper. Wounded, mm. maybe, but still deadly. I'd already taken out one eye. I damn near carved out the other. We were headed for the void at the crater's edge. Blinded, she was spiraling deeper. I had a choice. Hold on, or let go. I clung for dear life as she took us deeper. I had one minute of air in the tank. Back then, I could go another three with what I had in my lungs. So I had four minutes to kill the Reaper, minus a few to get back to the surface. It ain't that I like killing folks. It's just sometimes what you need is on the inside of someone else's rib cage. I hate I that I like killing that folk. Beautiful, terrifying creature, and I made for the surface. When I caught my breath, I realized we'd come further than I thought. I was surrounded by watery void, just me and ocean. Nothing else. Dang, that would be so sketchy. Dude, she's she did some crazy stuff though that far out to sea swimming back for land wasn't an option her story is I kind died of bonkers. from exhaustion long before i made it to shore all i could do was survive long enough to wash up somewhere i felt a suction and suddenly there were vast jaws rising out of the water towards me it had taken hours for the reaper's corpse to float to the surface using the knife i clambered up her flank and got a perch on top I figured she'd float for a few days at least. Enough for me to catch my breath. But would she sink before or after I died of thirst? True. I had a knife, a repair tool, and three liters of water. At least I wasn't going to die of exhaustion. Now, those reapers, they're practically all muscle. But there's some fat in there. I was able to keep warm and drink the water. And I didn't have much. But I had that repair tool, so I had Welcome a spark. Welcome aboard, Captain. It took a week to light that first fire. And I know more about the burning properties of Reaper fat than I ever cared to. I had to ration fires, but as they burned, I could smoke meat that I carved out of the beast's rib cake. Dang, that lady's a survivor, man. The stuff she did. Bonkers. Oh, we have um, rock punchers. Nice. Uh, let's see. Let's throw these other eggs we got on in there. See what these are going to be. We got all kinds of posters and pictures we can decorate with. But, um, yeah, I think that just about does it for today. So I'm going to go ahead and do my outro, and then we can throw a raid somebody's way for Twitch. But uh, let's grab a save. And uh, anyways, guys, thanks for watching another episode of Sonatica Below Zero. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button down below. That helps me out a bunch. Subscribe to the channel and turn on those notifications so you're not going to miss out on future streams or videos. Join the Discord if you would like to come by and chat. And if you want to help support on YouTube, it's only 99 cents to become a member, but that gets you a bunch of cool perks, like access to a 24-7 cross-platform vanilla Minecraft server that you can join when you want or with me on... Fridays and whatever other day I'm going to stream it. I'm going to do two of them a week. But you also get emojis, stuff like that you can use. Uh, drop a follow on Twitch if you're interested, if you want to keep up to date on any of my future streams over there, if you watch over there, or if you would like to watch over there. Try and hit the goal of 50 uh, followers, so that helps out a bunch. But anyways, guys, thanks again for watching. Hopefully we'll see you in the next one. Peace.